in some of the questions um, you might have to convert an english statement a statement which is given in english into you know a statement which is containing these variables propositional variables the reason is it will be easy for us to uh, if you have see one thing is if i have to use this statement and use many parts of the statement many times and finally draw a conclusion it will be difficult to write them so many times so what people do is it is called a shorthand representation they'll just use some variables for each part of the statement or the entire statement itself and later when we have to repeat the same statement instead of writing it completely we just use the variables right so now i'll show you how to do that so let's read uh, right, let's read this very very simple it is very simple straightforward you can access the internet only if it is there so only if it is a hint okay and then you are a computer science major or you are not a freshman there are three statements here right so it is better that you use three variables but then see how the options are given sometimes they will give you the they will they will they will say you this is one statement let's call it p they'll say you that and this is other statement let's call it q and this is other statement let's call it r they will say like this and then you are supposed to know you know say express it in terms of the logic okay uh, using the connectives now let's let's see what can you draw from this one thing is you can see that q is there and then r is you know this r is here so which means there is a between q and r there is a connective therefore you can represent these two statements as q or r this is this is how you can represent these two now what how can you do this p you can access the internet right so you can say p now only confusion you have is whether q or r will imply p or p will imply q that is a confusion isn't it so there is no other way you can resolve this confusion only way is you have to by heart various representations that i have given you for conditional statement there is no other way i tried i tried many things but then this is the only way yes it is difficult but then only if you can remember that it will be very easy this is a very small question please remember that so if you if you if you remember the table that i have given you alternate ways of representing this implication only if if it is involved then whatever is before it that is called as hypothesis that will form the hypothesis and whatever is given after this that will form the conclusion right therefore in this case this is hypothesis and this is conclusion so you are supposed to write like this okay that is the only confusion everything is remaining is straight forward right and what 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 other forms they can ask you the question is they'll say what each uh, statement is as a variable and now you are supposed to manipulate the variables for example here we are we are thinking that this entire statement is or you are not a freshman is or if they if they say that or represents this statement you or a freshman now how can you represent this center part this particular statement that you are not a uh, this uh, uh, freshman you are supposed to represent it using negation or in that case here negation or will come got it okay with more examples it will be easy we shall see lot of examples fine hi if you are planning to do masters then doing masters abroad is better than doing masters in india i'll give you all the reasons so first reason is out of 1 lakh students who take gate every year there are only 500 seats in old iits so all the iits put together have a acceptance rate of 0.5% and iit is university is better than iit is they have very good acceptance rate like 30% 40% but all the iit is put together have an acceptance rate of 0.5% and if you are working hard to get into iit bombay iit bombay is ranking is 177 and iit roorkee is ranking is 400 if you are happy to get into iit roorkee then getting into university is better than iit roorkee is easier compared to getting into iit roorkee and looking at the salaries for computer science of uh, for software jobs if you have done your masters in computer science in us the salaries are ranging from 80 lakhs per year to 1.2 crore per year so even if you take an average of 1 crore per year 
your savings will be much higher than the salaries in India. After taxes and your cost of living, you can easily save 40 to 50 lakhs uh, per year. And in India, the maximum jobs that you get is around 30 lakhs. So your savings will be much greater than the salaries in India. And these are all the services that we provide. University shortlisting. So depending on your profile, we will shortlist what are the universities that you have to apply. And statement of purpose building. And then LOR guidance. And GRE and English test assistance. And education loan assistance. So you don't have to have any collateral. Which, which means without any security, now you can get education loan. Getting education loan is very simple these days. And whatever the amount fee, the amount of uh, fee that you have, you have a range of uh, universities. You can apply for 10 lakh universities, 20 lakh universities, or 50 lakh universities. But whatever it is, you are going to get complete education loan, and you can pay off your education loan in one year after you getting a, after you get a job. And then we do visa assistance, mock visa interviews, and then connecting with the university alumni. So now you might ask why we should join Game of Visas. So the answer is we have 90% success rate, 99% success rate. And these are all the destinations that we guide the students to. So we guide students to any country that you want to go. So now it is not just USA. We guide to UK, Germany, Australia, Canada. So we guide, we guide students to all the countries. We work with all the destinations. And if you are interested in going abroad, you have to just drop us a message on this WhatsApp number 9494 555 454. Okay, thank you.